about getting back to the land with a little help? Chef and author Georgia Pellegrini wants to take you on an adventure getaway to hunt, fish, and find your inner modern pioneer. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome to Green Bay. Thanks for having me. I know you're stopping by in Kohler for this adventure getaway. I am. What is a modern pioneer and, and why did you leave the corporate world to become one? You know, I really wanted to find ways to get back to the land. And for me, modern pioneering is what I call manual literacy, the idea of rolling up your sleeves and just being a little more interactive with the land and, and with life and, and being a little bit more self-sufficient, being a little more fearless in the world. And that's what you're going to be teaching women in color at this adventure mm -hmm. getaway. And, and that means fishing, hunting. Yep, absolutely. So for the past few years, I've been teaching women new, new exciting skills from hunting, fishing. We do clay shooting. I teach them how to dress a bird, how to cook it. We do lots of wonderful cooking classes. And then we have the fun stuff like scotch tastings by the fire at night, s'mores, and then morning yoga in the lake. Obviously, Kohler has an amazing property, so there's all sorts of fun activities that we get to do. Yeah, you can even sign up for a massage, I guess, if you, you wanted sure to can, while you're absolutely. there and, and hang out in the spa. It sounds great, like a women bonding kind of an experience, it's, but then yeah. you're, you're learning this idea of kind of getting back to our roots. Almost. Yeah, it's girl bonding at its finest. You know, women often come alone. They don't know anybody, but they show up and they make friends for life. They, they have reunions long after they leave. And it's just really a wonderful way to see women sort of encourage each other to try new things, step outside mm -hmm. their comfort zone, be a little bit more fearless, and they leave feeling a little bit taller by the end of the weekend. Now here in Northeast Wisconsin, we have hunters, we have fishers, women who do this all the time. Who are you hoping to grab? Who, who are your adventure getaways for? You know, we have people who come who have never even held a gun or, or shot a shotgun before. Um, and then we have people who are more experienced. So we break them up into groups based on their experience level. And it's really an environment to try new things, to really I, just, you know, push yourself outside of that comfort zone. I heard that you, you're um, attracting, like, lawyers and, and people, CEOs. Absolutely. People who started in a, in a corporate world like I did and are suddenly wanting to do more than just a typical spa getaway. And, you know, I actually tell people if you can't come to the hunting and the fishing, we were doing a cooking class and a sort of hands-on demo on Sunday. As well as, long as, as, long as, a, as well as a book signing. So, Well, let's talk about your book. Okay. You just started promoting it. It's Modern Pioneering. Mm -hmm. What's it all about? So it's basically about, um, like I said, manual literacy. So no matter how busy or fast-paced your life is, there are ways to get back to the land, even if the land is just a patio planter or a fire escape or a really? windowsill. Absolutely. City dwellers can do City this. City dwellers can do it. You can grow 25 pounds of potatoes in a garbage bag on your fire escape. And so the idea is getting a little dirt under your fingernails and getting back to sort of those skills that our grandparents' generation had that we've all sort of lost touch with. Some DIY projects in there, recipes. Tons of DIY projects, recipes, uh, ideas for having a self-sufficient pantry. Um, you know, looking out and seeing what's growing in your sidewalk cracks that's edible. Sort of just thinking about the world in a, in a more open-minded, sort of back-to-the-roots way. How has this idea changed your life and how do you hope to inspire others? You know, for me, it's just allowed me to sort of interact with nature rather than keep it at arm's length. And I want people to get more in touch with things that are more real and lasting versus this very fast-paced life, this sort of virtual reality that we all surf with the, mod the modern world. And I think it's important to be balanced that way. It makes us better human beings, better stewards of the land, better to one another. And, and these adventure getaways are really an entry point for people to really start to do and regain some of those skills again. Well, I know you're connecting with a lot of people on Twitter, on Facebook, on Pinterest, and, and you can and get her new book, too, at Amazon or in bookstores. But well, let's invite people to Kohler. Yes, it's uh, April 3rd through the 6th, and it's going to be an amazing time. It's People say it's the adventure of a lifetime, and then on Sunday at 1 o'clock, we're having a cooking class. If you can't make it for the whole weekend, it'll be a fun cooking class and lunch. Well, Georgia Pellegrini, thanks so much for stopping thanks by. Thanks for having me. Love all your ideas, and we'll share them with you on our Facebook page, or yes, on our website, excuse me, fox11online.com. Click on Good Day Wisconsin, and we'll put all the links uh, that we mentioned right there for you. Thanks again. Thanks for having Have me. fun in Kohler.